A whole lot of y'all watching this video have a lot of potential to be great. I'm going to be honest with you. A whole lot of y'all watching this video have the potential to be great. But guess what? A whole lot of y'all watching this video with the potential to be great won't be great. Only a handful of y'all will be great and majority of y'all won't be great. And I'm going to tell you exactly why that is so. Because you're addicted to convenience. And the way the world is going now, things are getting even more convenient as the world turns. So it's just getting more convenient. And what people fail to realize that conveniency hinders brilliancy. So conveniency ultimately makes you lazy. You understand me? And before we get started with today's message, I want to tell you a little short story about a client of mine. One of my clients came to me, Leo, as a matter of fact, <clears throat> because he had been struggling in his business. He had been having a problem because he was hiring people that were not the right people. Okay. So he came to me, said, Tony, I'm not hiring the right people. I said, well, you know, tell me, why do you think you're not hiring the right people? He said, well, Tony, be honest with you and Frank, I really think I am hiring the right people because I'm hiring people with similar lifestyles. You know, we have a lot of similar personalities and traits and things of that nature. And my client, Leo, he, his personality type was more of a driver and expressive type of personality. So he pretty much <clears throat> hired people that had all his strengths and then at the same time had all his weaknesses as well. And because he built the team of many me's and people like himself, it was literally costing him $2,225,000 no, $2, per quarter, literally. So I said, wow, that's a lot of money. So you're, you're, that's $8.9 million per annually that you're flushing down the toilet. Did I hear you correctly? He said, yes, Tony, <laughs> you heard me correctly. I said, wow, that's, that's, you know, that's a serious number to be really missing out. Um, I said, you want to know what your problem is, Leo? Let me tell you what your problem is. He said, yes, Tony, please tell me because that's why I came to you. I came to you. You're an expert in this industry. Please help me out. I said, first of all, your, your addiction to convenience hindered you. Your addiction to convenience led you and misguided you when it came to hiring people that were like you rather than hiring people that were better than you. And I said, you know, I said, do you understand what I'm saying? He said, yeah, Tony, I kind of do. I said, well, let me ask you another question. Have you ever seen that, mo that movie, Wolf of Wall Street? And he said, yeah, yeah, that was, he said, I, that's the movie with Leonardo DiCaprio. I said, yes, absolutely. And he paid a character called Jordan uh, Belfort. And Jordan Belfort put together a team, a trusted team of lieutenants, you know, of people who possessed skills, people, traits and qualities and strengths that he didn't have. Every skill that he, Jordan was deficient in, he brought people on that were strong in those skills. You know what I'm saying? So he found people, he hired people that were better than him. You know what I'm saying? And he said, yeah, Tony, I know exactly uh, what you're saying. And at this point, you know, the client said, well, you know, what, what should I do to, to, to really correct this problem? I said, well, um, so him and I, we, we, you know, we sat down, we, we, we tailored a successful plan that ultimately helped him recover that $8.9 million that he was losing annually. So he was able to come up with an effective solution on how to hire the right people. And we're going to go over that right now, the exact solution that I prescribed to him in order for him to resolve his situation. And the moral of the story is my client Leo learned a huge lesson. He became aware of his addiction to conveniency and he overcame his addiction to conveniency. You know what I'm saying? By making sure to get informed so that he could transform by hiring the right people for his situation. So let's dive right into the lesson, the message for the day, because it is so important. And this exact message I prescribed to him and he 
was able to recover and get that $18.9 million that he was losing annually. So listen closely, take out a piece of paper, you definitely want to pay attention. And the five reasons why you should start hiring people who are better than you. The hiring process can be a humbling one if you're looking to build a strong team, a trustworthy team. Business leaders and owners often tasked with vetting, vetting excuse me, and onboarding new leadership team members. But workplace competitiveness can often complicate the process. While healthy company culture generali- generally prioritizes the work for a team over any one individual. Okay? And a certain level of competition among employees is inevitable. Before we go any farther, make sure you put some love in your body. You know I like to drink tea. Today I'm drinking lemon ginger tea. It's really good with the digestive system. So take a sip. Mm, That's right. Okay. So the first reason why you should hire people that are better than you is it gives you it gives you a challenge. Extending an offer to someone who has professional qualities you may not currently have will challenge and inspire you to be a better leader within your workplace. Surrounding yourself with intelligent people helps you continue to learn as a wit- as you witness new ways to tackle issues and alternative approaches to business practice and processes. Both the team and the organization will benefit from this healthy competitive energy, which can lead to more innovation, better customer service, and more. The second reason why you should hire people that are better than you. It frees up your time. Okay, Time is money. Money is time. I know you heard that before. Look at the time that one of the most common reasons why managers don't delegate work. With a strong and supportive team in place, however, it becomes easier to, easier to divvy up that workload. Which, after all, can be, you know, make... Make the whole team confident because people know taking over your task are fully capable of executing them. And as a result, you free up time to work on other items. This could translate into winning new clients, following up with existing accounts, and having the ability to represent your company more at events. Just think of it. You know what I'm saying? The third reason why you should hire people that are better than you. It improves company culture. You understand me? A strong company culture is one of the most sought after qualifiers, quali- quantities, excuse, qu- uh, 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 qualities, qualities that our employers, that employees are looking for. You know what I'm saying? So when you onboard a team member who is better than you in some way, you publicly validate the fact that you're seeking shared success interests of prioritizing your own interests. You know what I mean? Existing employees and even prospective candidates will pay attention and your care for the culture will rub off on them. As a result, productivity and brand perception might even just take a boost, might just jump up and spike. Uh, Potential vendors, clients, and partners will also take notice and it will strengthen your overall reputation in the industry. You know what I'm saying? Third reason why you should hire people that are better than you. It brings new perspective. New employees always bring fresh perspectives. When you when that when those employees also have talents and expertise, they can they can advance your business in ways you never dreamed of. That all-star hire can just streamline your process, perfect customer service, and even the prime comp- and even prime your company for an extension. You know what I'm saying? So hiring people who constantly push the envelope is a tried and true tactic that a successful leaders continue to use. To quote Steve Jobs, it doesn't make sense to hire smart people and tell them what to do. We hire smart people so they can tell us what to do, as Steve Jobs said. The fifth reason why you should hire people that are smarter than you is it strengthens and it supports the whole team as a whole. You understand me? Just as a new hire will help ease the workload, they can also take the weight off the entire team's shoulders by providing strategic and knowledge knowledgeable support. Burnouts is prevalent and is a prevalent is prevalent and understaffed, 
and you know fast paced environments but you know what i'm saying this whole team can work more confidently when they know that they have the support that they need in place you know what i'm saying with additional support and a stronger team in place productivity will likely skyrocket and yield a new opportunities innovation and even expansion having the right team members in place is essential for long-term success and growth of any business you know what i mean Managers are able to accomplish more, better support their team, and strengthen the culture when they start hiring people that are better than themselves. If after trying these above tips and you're still having problems hiring people that are better than you, you may want to talk to a third-party recruiting firm like my company, RNA Search Inc., because we could help you build that successful team. In conclusion, these are the five reasons why you should hire people that are better than you apply this uncommon information to bring restoration to your situation i hope you never want as long as you live and you live as long as you want i pre make sure that you guys like this video subscribe to my channel share it with others i really appreciate it i love you and have a fabulous day